There we go. That was weird. I don't understand why that was so difficult. Let's see here. There we go. Alrighty. What is going on, my prosy friends? My name is Winter Cassis, and welcome back to Lies of P. It's been a little bit, and I'm really excited to get back into the game, because I'm curious. I remember where we last left off. We were heading towards the manufacturing, uh, like where the puppets were made. Which this ought to be interesting. Do, do, do. I don't remember how to fight though. I cannot fight in here, but there should be yes, training area over here. Hey, Tiny. Don't mind me, I'm just, uh... It's been a minute since I played, so I have to remember how to... Okay, that's the one where I cannot block. Early stream, indeed. My guard, hold on. There we go. I had to stress the fuck out. I had to stress the fuck out for hours to try to make, make a schedule for my coworkers and myself. Oof, dad. You, man. I don't know if you saw, but a cursed reach campaign. There was a cursed. Uh, there was a cursed reach campaign. You have my attention. Oh, so hi, Cameron. How's it going? I feel like we were just talking. But Tiny, why did you have to make a schedule? There we go. Alright. I'm going to be ill during D&D &D this next week. I mean, yeah, I can imagine. Is What's going on? Okay, so according to Petto, we need to head towards... Good question. Apparently, I'm the fucking manager. Say what? How are you the manager? <laughs> curse campaigns are a modded campaign made by a community. Popular features of curse campaigns are Minecraft, Among Us, and worse. Okay. Like impossible guns and vehicles. Alright. Like, tiny, man. Like, I, I hope things get better for you. Jesus. Wild. Hi, Stray. How's it going? Hello, guys. Aside from Tiny's terrible here it situation. Is. The Nini works. Everything you see here belongs to the Nini. The classiest playboy and most brilliant inventor in Krat. Just ask him. Just puppets. Almost every machine and tran and crod is supplied from here. You gotta be curious about the guy. What kind of person is he? Uh, oh, I enough. wish we could find him. Fair enough. That is, if he's still kicking. 
That was going well for you. It's going all right for me. Got to say, got a new water heater, got a new car. Today I was told by someone apparently we're having a special on Friday that I was not told about. Then we closed the grill to have a meeting at 2 today. The grill will now be open until 6 p.m. when it was open till, until 3 p.m. So basically, they're extending your hours. That's a big oofter right there. <coughs> miracle cure. Buy the miracle medicine here. The miracle alchemist Clark Shore, also known as Dr. Cure All, has succeeded in making a cure for the horrible plague that has spread through Krat. Made from unicorn horn, blood of a two headed snake, and boiled down mandrake, Clark Shore has tested it, uh, tested it himself and confirmed that it completely cures the plague. I don't know about that. Uh, the Blue Plague is not a divine curse. Don't be afraid anymore. Come see Dr. Cureall, Clark Shore. Prices may vary as it is a limited item. Extending my hours, but gave us a completely fucked schedule, and since my coworkers don't speak much English, I was given a great job. I was given the great job of making the damn schedule. Want to know why I? I'll be, uh, Ill. I'll be ill on Saturday. I'm listening. Can't break those barrels. It'll be it will be after working two twelve hour shifts. Ah, uh, you know, Tiny, why don't you give yourself a break, my dude? Uh, I'm about to say, please, for the love of God, do not hurt yourself on my accord. I'm here to try to have fun with you, not. But if you're gonna su be suffering, like, the last thing I want is to force you to do, like, try to be awake after that. Alright. Fable Catalyst. Alright, I'm probably gonna need some more air to go. I'll be off on Sunday, though. I mean, good for you! But, ow! Go, 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 go. Shit. Correct, nerd. I'm working Monday, Friday, and Saturday next week. Uh, oh, 12 hour shifts, though. Why? Why? Why the 12 hour shifts? I get four days off, but three 12 hours. That's not a good trade-off. No. How do I... I have to remember how to do this. It's fine. I'll be fine. It doesn't sound like you'll be fine. Okay, I have to remember how to do this. That's not what I meant to do, but I wasted that. That's great. There we go. Chimney Christmas. I have to remember how to do this. Ow! Sir, that hurt. Seriously? Ow.
As a 3 p.m. it won't be too incredibly busy. But still, at the same time... Good lord, you hit really hard. Start private. Won't be too incredibly busy, but it's like it's from 6:30 a.m. to 7 p.m., which is rough to begin with. But it's like, dude, I work 10-hour shifts, and I know how exhausting they feel afterwards. And I used to do, like, those ridiculous, like, you know, ki kitchen shifts. I'm the one who chose this schedule for myself because the four stooges we have as bosses dropped this new schedule on us with about a week's notice. So, in, in other words, they're terrible bosses. Yeah, it's a good thing I did all that fencing practice, yeah. I'm covered in oil. Yes. Like tiny man. I, I'm normally one to like, you know. But it's just the fact that, like, for exclusive, obtrusive, intrusive, transmittal. For me, Arlecchino, the king of all riddles. King of riddles? Now, you know what I'm called, and why I called you. I want to know your name, but not till we're through. For as soon as I learn that one riddle burned, and I do love a mystery, don't you? Sure. Now, only the living solve riddles, and everyone knows that it's a must. When your city is so full of puppets, it seems are about fit to bust. <laughs> it's time for the riddle. No more waiting. We thank you for participating. All right. Human. Correct. Fantastic insight. That's a cla that's a classic. Uh, that's a classic riddle. Rhyme, you know. I'm not a caricature. I'm the king of riddles. That said, how do we know you didn't just get lucky? Even a stop clock is right twice a day, and even a puppet can be accidentally correct just by random chance. <laughs> Still, a promise is a promise. Our Lucino, tell him what he'll get. Cool. He seems like a fun character. So I take it every time I hear a phone ring, it's worth. That is my favorite character. Arlequino. Like, by far. So if the phone rings, I should just answer because I know it's Arlequino.
Will he just call random phones? I have to turn up my volume to make sure I, oh, I'm listening. Yes. Do we know? Just random ass places around Krat. So cool. I love his voice acting near as mu near as much as I love Wilfred Warps it. Hello. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Fratch, you be sure you go here. I wish I could do a good Wilfred Warps dash, man. Oh yeah, that's right. I gotta go to. Uh, I forgot, this is like Dark Souls. If I want to level up, I gotta go talk to my uh, Fire Link Maiden. But no, that's completely fair. I, I like, sometimes it's always, the, sometimes it's the side characters that win you over, you know? Madam. Now that we have a moment, you must understand. The city is on its deathbed. Uh, yes, I did get my first the record. Disease spreads too and it made me very sad. And the puppets rampage everywhere. Nobody knows what caused the disaster. Everyone in Krat is just trying to survive. Mm -hmm. That's why I found you. Our only hope. We're both unique. I am able to wield the power of Ergo. Did you listen to it? I did. It made me very sad. I loved it. It's a beautiful song, but it like Please save Krat. I'll use my power to I don't remember how much I need to level up. Yeah, I figured I needed like sixteen. I just didn't know if it was around twenty yet. Who's up bigger again? It's just a very beautiful song, but it's like it hurts with my soul. Feel is my favorite record because most of the others are in French. Honestly, that's not a deal breaker for me. I do listen to music from uh, in other languages. But I really like feel, but it makes me it makes me feel things, obviously, which I mean makes sense. And every time I hear her saying like close your eyes, it makes me think of the song. Uh, it makes me think of the song from the. Uh, It isn't a deal breaker, but it's still the best. No, I understand. And I mean, I, who knows? I might listen to those and go like, you're right, it feel is the best one. But it makes me think of that song by uh, Epic. Like, it's a, it's a musical. I forget when the name of the song is, but it's like... Feel comes from a woman who the petrification disease blinded her so she couldn't see her baby. Yep. And I gave her a baby doll and essentially lied to her, which made me feel even worse. Electric Blitz is effective for certain puppets. Get out if you're if you're not a stalker.
Flies make you human. I mean, fair. But you can understand where it's like, it makes me feel like an asshole, though. In a way, though, it feels better to make her feel better at the end. Oh, when, okay, Winter, those bots have, like, all the poise. Yes! Oh, Kareed! So you dodge your blocks and their attacks are slow. Mm. Apologies, I'm a little rusty. I haven't played it in a minute. Even better is tomorrow I'll be playing more uh, Bloodborne. Because I'm playing through the DLC. It is in fact at the end since she dies shortly after you give her the doll or the baby. Yeah. It's okay, pal. Gemini's looking out for you. Again, makes me feel better. Like it makes me feel better that she's happy at the end, but at the same time, it's like I fucking lied to her. Did you go back to the kid in the window? I haven't in a bit. No. Should I? I talked to her. I talked to him for a bit. Hold on. <clears throat> Was there a piece of dialogue that you could get from talking to him again? Ah. Go to the police officer's boss room. Okay. I mean, that's easy. I haven't really explored here yet, so. And I will gladly take little uh, Easter eggs. Courtyard. Let's start by going to the boss room. That over there. Friends. Faded whistle. Aww. Well, I got the whistle. that window now that you have the whistle go back to that boy in the window I have to remember where he is which one is he closer to oh it gives a little thing okay that's cool Yeah, this game actually helps you to go with going through quests. That's awesome! Okay, this... Ah, oh, shit. God, I wish there was a map. I know it's down there, but... The other way? Okay. I'll trust you, Tiny, because I don't remember.
There we go. We're going the I'm doing this to make you sad. Oh. Okay. If only we could play together like we used to. Murphy, I miss you. If only we could play. Murphy. Do I... Put your inventory and you use the whistle. Hey, that sound. Is that you, Murphy? I know that whistle. It must be Murphy. <sighs> Thanks for coming by. I want to play, but I feel too sick. I don't think I can. I miss Zack and Sophie and Eric. I wish we could all play. Ray and Eric go fragment. Oh, I can't even talk to them anymore. Aww. God, this game, just like Dark Souls, just. some lore or says you probably won't do new game plus I mean I if I like the game enough but I mean I'll take some information in case I don't jeez Similar to Dark Souls, this uh, this game does hit like that that sadness factor. Showing me things that make me sad. The big police bot you fought was Murphy, their friend. It was giving out screeches and noises, but later in the game you get an item called an Ergo Wave Reader. Does it tell me what they're in New Game Plus? You find the screeches and noises it actually is trying to speak. Oh my god! Are they like trapping people in these puppets? Open the door. It can. Door shut permanently. Hi. Hi, Jay and Larry. How's it going? Ow! Sir, that hurt. your time as a liar? I mean a little bit.
There we go. It was pissed because it blamed you and adult puppets for infecting their friends and making them cold. Wow, this game gets darker by the moment. I mean, yeah, I knew the game was going to be dark. It's like, it's a Souls game. Souls games were never meant to be happy. <laughs> Holy hell. Holy hell what? He's improving. I know, right? May Madge, baby. Winter, don't go down there. I figured I shouldn't. Clever season. Let's see. That's a mini boss fight that you need to clean the poison if I don't go down there. Oh, so it's like that boss fight from Dark Souls 2. Ow! Douche. Winter is not a man or a woman. Winter is a season. I mean, you're not wrong. I am indeed a season. Oh! I have pizza and matzo sticks. Nice. Me and Abby had chicken sticks and salads for lunch. It was delightful. Do, 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 do. I wish I had pizza and matzo sticks. I mean, don't we all? You guys are gonna be the rough ones. So this is a way to go up and down. I want to see how many places I can go to. Uh, I wish I knew how to cook chicken because I wouldn't make that shit every night. I do love chicken. Are you kidding me? Love chicken skewer salad wrap. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Pizza and mustard sound divine. Divine. Okay, it looks like... Ooh, chest. Guys, there's a chest there. I need it. Oh, yes, but no. Temp oil oven. I mean, yeah. Dude, these guys hit hard. There we go. Alright. You don't cook chicken in a pan? I mean, I cooked chicken, I cooked ch chicken on the grill earlier. Dear Mr. Panigi, as, your pa as per your orders, I conducted a quality investigation on the ergo supplied by the alchemists. Of course, it was done secretly. Certainly, the quality of ergo was getting worse over time. I don't doubt the alchemists, but the decrease in quality is too widespread to call it a coincidence. At this rate, this quarter's puppets will have a high chance of defects. The most important thing is the quality of ergo, after all. Oh, the G is silent. Mr. Vanini. Thank you for the reminder, Tiny. I couldn't remember. According to a reliable source, the high-level alchemists are running ergo production experiments lately using another method. Personally, I think their secret experiments have something to do with the decrease in ergo quality. Are they wringing out the bodies of discarded puppets in the barren swamp or something? Anyways, I recommend approaching them carefully instead of complaining to them. Manager of Factory 1, Nicola. Throw it on a laptop and start up any video game ever. 
Also. Also. Mr. Benini. I'm still, like, gushing over the upgrade, upgrade of Henry's rifle. I mean, yeah. That's fair. I can understand. It's so good. Well, I mean, you put a lot of work into it. Um. Guys, I think the floor broke. Oh, fuck! I fell. Um, before going into this with full health. Um. Ow! Oh, God! Ow! Jeez. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Um. literally trapped in a corner. That guy's a bastard. He can and will rock your shit. Apparently. That rapier looks sick. Thank you. Oh wait, when I was first touched by dying because all I remember from the end was blue and seeing a massive wave of time magic. I mean, yes. That is exactly what happened. You guys moved a statue that was a, was essentially a DC a DC 60 to move. Fuck. Well, here we are. Ow, god damn it. Fuck. It was so late. It was. Yeah, I still don't know why everyone thought it was such a good move. It couldn't have known. I mean, did we do good? I mean, you guys moved something I didn't think you would. Honestly, egg on my face. Not a good thing to hear. Boss, ego recovered. Already dead. Can you tell me now, since he would have, while well, well, it was actually just strunk? I mean, shit happens. Whether it was a good idea or a bad idea, it doesn't matter. There we go. Henrik in the gate downsides. One might think. Legion caliber, a workshop's correction device developed to raise the hardness and density of... Okay. Alright. Can you just tell me now, since he would have seen, was it activating it or just strong? Basically, it wasn't... 
you get the sense that what you did was essentially while pulling out the statue without going into too much detail obviously uh, with pulling it out you got to the basically the core of which that power would reside and blue would be intelligent enough to realize that like what they pulled up was essentially what they were using the crystals to jump start oh hello a butterfly nearby So just strong. Yes. Heal up. Thermite. Hmm. There's a stargazer down there. But well, before we progress, I wanted to just see if there was anything else in this room. Okay, time for Blue to put that in front of his mansion. <coughs> uh, so, okay, so it is nothing super, super 10 out of 10 bad. I mean, debatable. It could be something really, really bad. The problem here is that you guys have so limited knowledge on what it is that you're going to have to wait and see what it does. Oh, yeah. How it goes? Can you tell I am tired? Indeed, I can, Tiny. <laughs> but at the end of the day, isn't D&D &D nothing but making some choices and seeing what happens? <coughs> Just like life. twice we're going back strong chronomancy huh sounds like magic for my gun <laughs> you know your gun would explode at least we didn't have all the energy amps there this is true this is very true if you guys would have like if you guys would have had like we're powering it like using the crystals as well God knows this would have been so much worse. <laughs> Herma, it's like your conversation. I'm gonna become Atlas. Dude, that'd be sick. No, bro, I'm not gonna lie. It, you know, you know, Herma, it just reminds me of what we were talking about last night. It's like, Oh shit, it's a nuclear bomb! Nothing anthrax can't solve! <laughs> Give it to Philman, Jesus. Oh, no. <laughs> Can't wait for the next session. Honestly, yeah, neither could I. I use my power to help you. My nuclear weapon of annihilation. Oh, Jesus Christ. No can have. I want something. Not sure what yet, but something. We'll figure it out. Honestly, we'll lose it. I have Vigor to 20. <laughs> Just something. Thank you, Sophia. We need to find a way to drain that poison. Tick tock. 
We might want more capacity. I will be boosting up more capacity, but first I figured I'd get that up to 20. I'll figure it out when the time comes. That's usually how this works, right? I mean, yeah. I feel you. Sometimes it just feels right. Um... Paul's made out of corpses. Enchant my armor. Fire axe. Ooh. Um, excuse me? Okay. Literally just trying to get a plus two to my holy sheep armor. Give it an ergo fragment. Dear God. Just rocking standard leather, pretty much. I feel lost. Though the armor can have an enchantment on it. It, it technically isn't magical. Correct. It is not. Well, it is. It's just not magically enchanted. Correct. Oh, fantastic! The pipe fit like a glove. Well, like a pipe <laughs> that fit. Idiots, you know. Like there is mad innate magic from it, but. It's a guy. It's true. Pulcinella. I hope he's all right. I mean, yeah. Mm, I'll let this guy pass. Mm. Keep going. Yeah, I don't think you could hit me. I don't want to play that guess. I don't want to guess that. Fragment. Do, 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 do. All right, Benimi. Pull yourself together. You have a duty to this city. 
and to your own sterling reputation. Yeah, we had like, what was it, like 10 minutes? 10 minutes. Like a 10 minute. Panini! Oh, easy now! No need to kill me! Surely we can discuss this like reasonable. Wasn't very long. <laughs> People? Panini! Hold on. Geppetto's a friend of yours. Did he send you? Get a good leather, a good I, I'm, I, I'm fine. Please, help me find my butler, Pulcinella. Pulcinella? He's a and a friend. Those stalkers were supposed to be working for me, but... Uh, well, they yeah. bolted and left me to my fate. It was right here. That was not helpful. My butler went to barricade the back door, and I haven't seen him since. Pulcinella has been a loyal companion. I hate to lose him. The factory is, of course, my priority. We must take it back. But please, keep an eye out for my... For my butler. I'd consider it a personal favor and owe you in kind. Well, I mean, you guys are currently in Oceana. I mean, you guys could take a month and not do anything. If that's what you want. I'm not here to stop you. Before all this, I'm told he's still building an army of puppets. How did this nightmare come to be? Good question. Please, you must stop him before he does any more harm. Agreed. I don't need to teleport back. I don't have enough to level up. Really open and that was something I could knock down. Oh shit, I can't. Um. Ow! Run! No, 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 fuck! Shit. Ow. That hurt. Appreciate my death, ergo. Deserter, uh, wait, discard days a note. Hope I pronounced that name right. Uh, bag. Ah, uh, shit. Nope. Nope, that's me. Paperwork.
Had beef tips and mashed potatoes for dinner, but my food got cold because I spent time making the schedule. Oof. Ah, here we go. There we go. Discarder's note. Discard days in note. 189x dash, uh, 198x slash xx slash xx. The public cannot refuse the Grand Covenant imprinted upon the manufacturer. It must obey the creator's orders and cannot harm humans. But look at the boy, look at that puppet that once called, was once called uh, Fuego and the Grand Covenant flawed. It is the Grand Covenant flawed. The once fight, uh, faithful puppet now kills humans. It creates puppets instead of fire. It disobeys something else, other than it obeys something else other than humans. It's as if something is someone is controlling it, or ha or it has a mind of its own, as if there's a king of puppets somewhere. It, is it pretending to be human? Is it a simple defect? This that requ this requires further investigation. 18xx slash xx slash xx. It's surprising. Fuego's actions were not simple. Uh, were not were not simple obedience, but faith. Fuego worships something as God. Uh, something as God. I heard that the king. Uh, there's a king. There's the king of puppets on Rosa Isabel Street. That must be what it is. Control. What is controlling the puppets of Krat? But a puppet must. Uh, a puppet having a human ego is a problem from another dimension. Grand Covenant. Funny. Hey, you want a horn of blasting? Oh God. There is still a puppet's. Uh, there is there is, there is still a puppet's secret that I don't know about. Ergo is probably the key, but but those guys are awakening, like awakening like humans more quickly as days go by. Someone has to stop them before it's too late, for the sake of all humans. That's cool. The lore. Oh boy. Um, we've reached a problem. Well, Fuck's sakes. I can't get behind it. Woo. The arm that this guy has. He was getting ever closer. Motherfucker! Literally, you don't need to be behind the enemy when you stagger him. But the problem is, when I went to click it, it wasn't working. Like, I was trying to get up in, up in his business, and it didn't work. Like, it had the dash, like, the slash going through it. It could be that I just wasn't at the right, like, angle, or maybe I wasn't close enough. But either way, like, that was... Meh. I'm glad you mentioned infusions, honey. I mean, meh. How do I get to that one, though? You need the slash mark that hovers up uh, over them to glow before hitting them. Okay, fair enough. I have to figure out how to get up there because I can't jump, so. <coughs> there we go, now I'm back to back up, now I'm back to full health. I'll move on for now. 
Uh oh. Mayday, guys. Something's going wrong. No, I'm not gonna summon a specter. Oh, is this a boss fight? Oh, heck yeah, let's go! I just realized I only have one flask. Well, um... Especially since I don't know how this creature fights. You missed out on a massive portion of the area. Well... I mean, it's not like fighting the boss is going to prevent me from exploring. Destroy the environment, man. This is your boss room. Oh god. Ow. Oh god. Uh. Well, not end it, but just miss out on stuff. Well, I mean, it's fine. I died. I got time. Does that one enemy respawn? That's the question. The big guy doesn't respond. Okay, good. You know, you can have all the flasks in the world. That won't, uh, won't stop death. You're not wrong. Go outside, down the stairs, rather. Okay, hold on. I'm heading that way. I'm to drain the poison so I can beat this guy. Hello? Have you seen this eccentric? Have you seen this eccentric? Hot off the press news this uh, this month again. This uh, this month's eccentric is Mr. J, a gentleman who caused a stir by marrying a puppet. Oh gosh. Is it because the custom made puppet is so beautifully made, or that Mr. J's peculiar peculiarities even he was unaware of suddenly burst? Mr. J fell in love with the maid puppet at first sight, and they got married even in the face of his family's opposition. But the lover's secret wedding faced ruin. The enraged family stormed in. The husband was confused. The puppet bride was greatly damaged. She clearly had a soul. We loved each other, gentleman Jay, who became his family's headache. He still makes the, cl the same claims. He's been fixing his bride and redoing the wedding. This tragedy was made all possible because of Kratz's advanced puppet technology. Let's all listen to our families now. Haha. <laughs> the Have You Seen This Eccentric Corner will continue next month. Okay then. Worth it? I guess? Yeah. That is interesting. Let's 
Charge of Verification, Arm Pool. Doctor's Confessions. My name is Clark Shore. People call me Dr. Kirol. I intend to confess my sins. Oh, goody. I made innumerable medicine sales under the guise of it being a cure-all. At first, even I was sure about my experiment. Early on, the cure really was effective in neutralizing the petrification disease, and why would the great alchemist's records be wrong? I know I stole it, but I perfectly followed the manufacturing process. My cure was perfect. But what went wrong? I dare not record what the, what the one who got treatment turned into. That was a literal hell. And when, I, and when I realized that I was the gatekeeper who opened the doors, I ran away. How can I atone for my sin? I only tried to treat patients and earn a few extra coins. I'm dying, and this is my penance. I also have the petrification disease, but I'm not getting the cure. I'd rather turn to stone and freeze to death. God, please forgive my terrible sins. I mean, yeah, this definitely feels like Dark Souls. <laughs> Sure. Hi. Uh, should we talk? All puppets must die. Dr. Kirol dies from one. the petrification disease. I mean, yeah. I, I, I hear the sound of springs inside you. You're a puppet too. You can't fool me. Maybe cool. All puppets must die. Kill the puppets. I wish I'd known. Oh, surviving is a hell of its own. Jeez. I can't tell what's fried and what's oil. Doctor's promise, sorry. survivor's mask, survivor's hunting apparel. Uh, I was afraid to die. Oh, no. Aw, no books to actually explain, like, why you're like this? Okay, you're just like this. Fair enough. I don't know what I was expecting. I was... I don't know. Oh, I can't open that door. Ow. there now but why would I I would die from the poison shortcut back over here. I did never go through here.
This looks more of that poison. got to be a way to drain this. The thought of fighting you in this does not sound pleasant. It's not a little cave. Run, 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 run. Hey, Winter, what's up? Corruption is basically poison, but I think it's slower. It slows your stamina. Well, that's not good. Kiss my butt. Is that elemental arm Henrik has attunement? Uh, it should say in the item's description that I sent you. I believe for... Damn it, still not enough to... Is it for everyone else but not our first source? I believe so. Because when it was designed specifically, it was designed for artificers to... Because it is a fragment of what it is. No! Ugh! Oh. Needs repair tool. Oh boy. Run. Run. It is not. Coolio. Yeah. yeah. If I remember correctly, it was because of the fact that that is just a fragment, a piece of what it actually is. Is there anything else down here? I can't heal. I don't trust my timing right now. Shit! I got greedy. Henrik has two free attunement slots, yeah? Now if, now if Henrik started getting the rest of the pieces for that, then it would take up an attunement slot. But because it is just one piece. I just realized I lost the 2,000 that were in the boss's room, but I had already accumulated 3,000 from this, so... Uh, 
now. Um, Blue's gonna start having Philman train him and using his shield. Belrath was supposed to, but now he's gone. So he's gonna get him his boots of speed and a spell refueling ring. I mean, yeah. But I was saying, also Tiny, that's absolutely doable. But I was saying, as long as it's somebody who is pro, who is proficient with what you are trying to learn. Come on. Where is my air gun? My air gun is probably down there somewhere. Okay, I gotta let the corruption go away. Oh, buddy. Oh, there we go now. We're going to have to deal with this. Ergo, this continues to be a problem. Oh, I already got it. Never mind. Never mind. I guess I'm just a level of stupid that I haven't quite figured out yet. damage for one hit. I think it's because my guard broke. I didn't think I was that low in stamina. God, I need to kill this guy so I can actually fully explore this area. I have full corruption. Fuck me. God, that deals a lot of damage. Yeah, we're gonna just go to the Stargazer. God, 
this is so frustrating because they're also I think the game specifically has it so you can't it's harder to lure him Corruption lessens the amount of th your thing heals. That's not good either. Corruption is not a good time. I assume it's supposed to be like an acidic, uh, an acidic uh, chemical. Okay, I need to run past this guy. I need to aggro everybody else. Cell. Okay, so this does end in a dead end. Fuck, I can't wait till D&D. D&D &D is gonna be a good time. Need something fun this week. Got your back, buddy. Jesus, cry me. Run, run. I need to get away from it. Okay, they're dead. I gotta let the corruption go down. I'm gonna heal up. Go back to where Vanini was and go up the stairs instead of, uh, go down the stairs instead of up. Okay. Hold on, I'm gonna kill this guy first. Jesus criminy, that thing does a lot of damage. Magazine, Hidden Moonstone, Star Fragment. All right, Zabunk. This list that I defeated, and he, uh, I defeated him. He, 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 I defeated him. He's Bonk's friend now. He helped Bonk. All right. Back to the control room. Now, you said there's a staircase going downwards. I didn't see one in there, but I mean, I could have easily missed it. Because there was the staircase that went downwards over here. 
that just goes down. But like, was there one in here that goes down? You were saying right way, the right way when you say, was there one in here that goes down? Well, yeah, it could, like this went down, but it just leads to right here. in here. Hi Winter. Hi Jackson. How's it going? Oh, hello. Okay, hold on. Director. seem to follow me everywhere. Hi. Pleased to see you, my stalker friend. You made it all the way here unbothered by ruffians. You've got talent. I've never seen you before, but who cares? It's going pretty good, uh, but well just recently have been able to client. find the time to watch your streams again. Did well, I appreciate, uh, I appreciate the company. Moneybags himself, Lorenzini Vanini, is inside this factory this very moment. You caught us on our return trip. We had to deny his ridiculous request in person just to be sure it wasn't a joke. All we could do was laugh. Keep your whispers up if you're heading in there. He is the richest man in Krat. Or so they say. Who knows? Maybe he's handing out bags of money to lift his spirits. Ha! <laughs> That seems unlikely. No way are we doing that. Okay. Well, anyhow, best of luck. Lorenzini Vanini. Best of luck to you. Are you carrying the latest edition of Vanini's Landmark Guide? It's the most popular non-fiction work in Kratz these days. Maduro wrote the actual guide, but Vanini published and financed it. It goes for a premium at the shop, but Maduro might not get his cut. He went missing recently, which of course made that volume more popular than ever. If you can get all three volumes collectors want, that you can get four. No, five thousand for it at the shop. But you're in luck. I have a conscience and a powerful sense of self-preservation. I'll let this one go for five hundred. That's a good investment. Don't sleep through it. You'll wish you had this, and the price is a steal. Let me know if you have any interest. Ripped Vanini is Krat Landmark Guide 3. I'm sure, why not? I know a smart bargain when I... Ripped Vanini is Krat Landmark Guide the 3rd. This month's attraction, Rosa State. There's a warning. There's a warning band attached that bears the erring mark of Krat. Warning: This book has been banned. If found, please report it to the city. Reading banned books will result in punishment. Are you sure you want to read it? Some uneven handwriting is here. You were warned, but you are reading a forbidden book. You are a bad person. Well, you're reading it, so this is what you get. The roses bloom at the Rose Estate. Don't know the rest of it. The end. Reporter Cat. 
This guide was made with the support of the Red Lobster Inn. So, okay. have you had time to read it? It's the first volume I wrote, so go easy. <laughs> By the way, I need to mention something before it slips my mind. It's a shame that the original author went missing, but I fear you misunderstood this commitment. I am willing to sell my newest book for 500. No refunds, of course. <laughs> That's a given. But look on the bright side. That volume of this series is not easy to acquire. <laughs> Take care. Okay. I mean, it's interesting. Star fragment. I can't go there. Let's see. He literally sold you trash for 500. I mean, Patches sells you can and sell you rubbish. But he's the best boy. <laughs> Listen. Uh, listen, Patches gets the uh, Patches gets the free pass. Don't know why, but he does. Oh, this is a shortcut to that one area. Excuse me. Hello. Three, create one. You who open the door be one of the greatest. Question of the day. Did this factory worker ever think he would be destroyed like a puppet? Trinity room. I love him. Of course you love him, Tiny. Blue blood's tailcoat and quartz. Be one of the great ones. How do I get the book? Three, create one. He who opened the door. Tiny kit. Outfit. Oh, damn. That actually is pretty sick. Isn't this what he wears on the cover? That is actually one sick outfit. Goddamn. Looking good. No, stop it. No, no, no. But, uh, can you open this? Or do you need to get, like, all three Trinity keys in order to get the book? No, you can't. Damn it! this way. Come on. Ow! Holy crap! You guys do a lot of damage!
They're gonna catch you. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, no. Well, this guy is very dead. Babe, I got a new outfit. Look how, look how freaking dapper I look. Mm. Hmm? I say, do you think the cravat's too much? No, I think it's not enough. You know, you're right. The only thing is, I don't want to wear... to accessorize more. That's fair. I don't want to wear the top hat, though, just because I feel like his hair looks better without the top hat. Can you show me the top hat? Hmm? I said, can you show me the top hat? Yeah, hold on. I can show you. I'm in a safe place, so... Oh, that's character info. Doesn't look as good, yeah. Hmm. He does look better without it. Mm. Nah. I think he just looks better straight with the outfit. Speaking of, actually, I should quickly see if there's... <sighs> Ooh, but it downs... It really reduces acid damage reduction rate, but greatly improves fire resistance. Actually, this would be pretty useful right now. pretty badly there. Questions. Oh, thank you. Oh, I was overheated. Hmm. Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, I got a ways to go. I just realized I have a- I do have a shortcut. Eh, it's fine. It's fine. Do, do, do. Hi, Red Fox. Hi, Black Cat. How's it going? Yeah, that's where the shortcut goes. Problems I have to get there without using a ton of my I mean if you want to uh... Oh god no I just didn't want to burn the battery on my tablet. Actually, I should plug the tablet in since I'm using my phone. If you want to plug it in for me, I'd appreciate it. Can you tell there's an enemy there? 
No, not at all. He's right there. No, you need to leave this attack from, uh... RE7? Uh, yeah. At least he's not as bad as Tyrant. Oh no. <laughs> oh shit. What? Healing? He hits hard. <laughs> yes. Guy. That, that guy! guy. Oh. Shit. God damn it. Sir, I'm trying. Oh god, ow! Careful. Fuck me, Fuck. I got pinned. Damn it, I hate it when that happens. I, they're constantly making me fight in little passageways. Uh. Yeah. Jocelyn's bed. The Jocelyn's bed, gee. I mean, it wasn't even her clothes. Okay, let's try that again. Damn it, dude. Of course. At least you get to watch a fancy death animation when you die. You're not wrong, Jax. You're not wrong. I do look good when I die. Let's see if I can get that door open. A swordsmanship master's amulet in the hidden mile. Yeah. And the blade is good to go again. There we go, guys. We got it. Now, the question is what did I just do? That's the real question. Yeah. Your child on your side? Mm hmm. So when you're streaming, you. 
that's fair. Remove poison from the mini boss area. Ah, thank you, Tiny. I appreciate the clarification. I was just literally sitting there going like, what did I do? <laughs> what if I remove? What if I remove the poison? That means I can go level up a few times and then challenge the uh, mini boss. <coughs> <laughs> Best of luck to you. <laughs> Take care. Now, now the better question is how do I get down there without, you know, dying? Left for right in a second, let's head back to the Stargazer so I can... Let's head back to the Stargazer so I can level up a few times. Not really. I'm level 32. So, like, I could level up like three times, and maybe four if I use some of my extra ergo. Oh, by the way, right over there, Mr. Lorenzini Vanini. <laughs> He's the guy who runs the puppet factory. Mm. I think, like, with Geppetto, he's, like, one of the great puppet makers. Of course, I am his greatest invention. Not Vanini's, but uh, Geppetto's. Let's go ahead and boost up capacity twice. Geppetto is the creator of the Grand Covenant. Oh. And I think I should boost up vitality twice. Actually get some health, you know. Thank you, Sophia. Oh. I organize this place according to the rules, so don't touch do anything, you, Eugenia. For some reason, this place, uh, the place you're in, reminds me of the back room. This level, I mean, that's completely fair, there, Jackson. <laughs> Cat. Cat doesn't like me right now. T kitty, touch the kitty. I can't. It won't let me. Kitty doesn't like me right now. See, watch. You're too much of a puppet. Hi, but. But I want to be a real boy. I picked up traces of high-powered energy originating far. Why don't we make a legion arm with it? Mr. Vanini is the expert when it comes to legion arms. But I'm pretty sure I can make one. The puppets get fried easily by electricity. I have the full... Uh, the full menace. That's pretty cool, actually. You're going to the factory. He's the richest man in Krat. I heard he went to shut the factory down. Mm -hmm. hmm. I hope he's safe. I wouldn't want to lose my best customer. Well, you know what? I know my way around a weapon. Thank you. Ooh, 
dagger. How much would it cost to upgrade? So plus three now. I need a crescent moon stone if I want to upgrade it again, so. The best. I know my way around. Oh, you want to talk? About Vanini. Mr. Vanini is the richest man in Krat. Okay. His company manufactures most of Krat's exports. All right. He's a uh, peculiar, but a good-hearted man. Even though he's rich, he treats every employee with respect. I hope That's actually kind of hard to come by nowadays. Down. I hope he's safe. I wouldn't want to lose my best customer. Alright, I think that should be good. Thank you. Alright, now let's go fight a mini boss. The question is how do I get down to him? Oh, wait, I know how. I remember, it was like right at the beginning of the area. Hey, Mr. Vanini. Bye, Mr. Vanini. Because I can go across here. Shortcut over here, too. Oh, that's right, this area. Call What's up, Call of Dark Souls? How's it going? Praise the sun! Alrighty. Up it up the future. Fighting the giants in Dark Souls 3. Oh, ow! That's not what I meant to do. is really big. Ow! Get stabbed! Ow. 
worked. Three in, er, uh, Erico Chunk. Boosted Glaive. Ooh. My tablets work. My tablets. Thank you. GG, thank you there, Stray. I appreciate it. Big preach, big preach. Though, might I say, ow. I mean, I probably do have some stuff I could throw at him, but me. It's fine. I'll walk it off. But now I need to go level up like two more times and then it's time to challenge the boss. Because I don't think there's anywhere else to explore in this area. Doubles as a blade sharpener. That's it's pretty dope, right? All right, now but we need to go back, talk to Sophia, and level up twice. Just because I can't upgrade my weapon anymore until I get a crescent moonstone, and I can't, I don't want to upgrade any other weapons right now, but just because I like my rapier. I'm more of a dex build in this game, so. Uh, how much do I need to level up? I actually could check that. 23, so I'm gonna... There we go. Now I should have enough to level up twice. So let's go ahead and boost up capacity one and vitality one. There we go. Thank you. Big preach, big preach. Now to Vanini's works control room. Okay, now there's a boss I have to fight. Huh? Alright then. It's not me. Not me. Curious which child it was. Well, there's only one in the kitchen. It's Jessica. Yours. Yours? All our kids have to be first. Especially those. All right, let's see what this boss is all about. Worst case, I'm out 300 uh, air ago, so. is actually kind of crazy. Actually, 
Might as well go to full health then. If I can regenerate some of my stuff. Oh my gosh, what the hell? What was I in your hitbox? My bag of Sour Patch Kids didn't have, don't have that many blue ones in it. Blue ones are my favorite. Aww. Oh god, I miscalculated. No, 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 oh, ah. uh. This boss was pretty tough in my first playthrough. I imagine. Oh, fuck. Ow! You suck! I hate you! Well, now I have to fight with Reckless Abandon. Yes, dodge to the red, uh, dodge into the red glowing fist. Okay. <coughs> God dang, I wish my silences would stop. Have you used your quartz? No. I don't know what the quartz does. next time. Oh, is the quartz used to... Yes, I did. Yes, I did, Tiny. I beat the robot of the future. What's in that chest? Yeah! It's like a halberd. Sorry, no, not a halberd. Uh, forget what the weapon it was. Oh, fuck me. Man, he hits really hard. Uh, that weapon's handle the booster glaive. Thank you. Has my favorite moveset in the game. Ooh. Let's uh, teleport back to. Now lying. Apparently, I'm lying. That with the saber blade carrying me through the game, I never changed it. Ah, hey, that's the one I used before getting access to the boss weapons. By the way, guys, apologies if I ever, like, you know, cycle my words or something like that. I'm, my sinuses have been draining like crazy, so, like, every now and again, it just feels like something's lodged between my nose and my, my, nose and my mouth.
This gave me an extra pulse cell. Blink dodge. You're good, everyone stumbles their words at some point. True. <laughs> but mine is solely because of the fact that my sinuses are draining. I have a post nasal drip, which is super annoying. Do the link dodge? Alright. Cell charge <laughs> enhances guard regain recovery when attacking enemies. Charge legion when eliminating enemy one changes a certain amount of legion when an enemy is eliminated. Uh, lowers the stamina consumption of charge attacks. That would actually be really good. Perfect guard fable charge enhance one. Charges fable when a perfect guard is successful. Uh, increases the grinder's derby. This, this. Is there a bonus to, like, do I have to fill these out every time? Increases the amount of ergo gained from eliminating enemies. You have to fill it, and, or you don't get it. Okay, I was conf I was confused. Ooh, an extra amulet slot would be really useful too. Retain guard, retain. Mm. Excuse me. I have no more garnet, so. Extra amulet slot is main. Mm. Speaking of, I need to double check something. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Did you gain a new one? Increase the mass HP, and this increases damage inflicted on puppets. But this one reduces weapon durability to consumption. I'm not too worried about that. <coughs> this ought to be interesting. Alright, let's go try this again. Again, worst case scenario, I'm out 300. Uh, Link Dodge lets you dodge twice. Ooh. I'll have to try that out when I'm on the field. <coughs> Helps you dodge out of the way. Mm. And I'm here. Thank God, as a puppet, I can be transported through uh, via Erico. Okay. All right, we're going back in. Curious what Fueco says once you have the Ergo translator.
shit. Oh shit, I should have saw that coming. Did not see that move coming at all. <sighs> he just turned his ass around and shot me right in the face. <laughs> I mean, that's still not as bad as Lord Ishin like pulling out a Glock and just starting to shoot me. Special status ailment. When you use it, it removes overheat. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, motherfucker, let's go! Round four!
gain my stamina. That is a lot of range. my nose thank you I appreciate it I had an itch under my nose the whole time I had itch nose disease <coughs> there 
There we go. Okay, I defeated this guy, which is good. I assume I need to keep moving forward. But first, we're using the Stargazer, because I need to... I need to level up a few times. Excuse me. Let's see here. Alright. So I got 7,000 and I need 2,500 to level up. So I should be able to level up about three times. But... If I use two of these, I should guarantee it. three times so let's go ahead and boost up let's boost up bigger capacity and vitality I am his power. Able to wield ergo okay they call me a listener because I can hear ergo you are work for the dark brotherhood I inherited the power you from are a listener who hated it called it the devil's power so I kept it a secret that I could talk to puppets now you are the only one my voice reaches so I beg you please save Krat okay ah if it isn't my savior glad to see you made it back in one piece my friend there you are my boy my Savior, yes, that's the word. You took back the factory, and I cannot thank you enough. Without the factory, no more new puppets. The army has run out of recruits. <coughs> My friend, you saved, well, all of us. Ah, but listen to me going on and on about my concerns, and I don't believe I've even introduced myself. Signor Lorentini Venigni, gentlemen, bon vivant, and, at the moment, utterly at your service, my friend. Okay. If the name Venigni rings no bells, perhaps you've heard of Kratz, Prince of High Society. That is because they are one and the same. Just two of the many names I've collected in my three decades here on Earth. While I sincerely believe meeting Venigni is its own reward, You're my favorite character in this game, completely fair. In a more uh, traditional manner. Please, Please take, take this. this. My, my newest, newest prototype. prototype. It'll be, It'll safe be the safest for you. It's a grinder stone that keeps granting special attributes to the grinder. I hope you'll put it to good use. I mean, I won't say no. Special grindstone. You can equip the special grindstone <clears throat> on a grinder, though Vanini or a, through Vanini or a Stargazer. There are different types of special grindstones that grant different effects to your weapons. You can use the special grindstone effect in battle only once, <clears throat> but it recharges if you revive or visit a Stargazer. It's a weapon buff you can use once for life. Nice! I come to you with only the most peaceful intentions, and as a true friend of Kraft. Behold, Venini Warp, where we will honor the city of Kraft's history while forging her brilliant future. When I broke ground on this place, we broke ground. <laughs> I certainly didn't do it all personally. This was a simply empty space. A blank canvas. But in the hands of a maestro, it became a work of art. All my life, from boyhood to this very day, I have been derided for my, let's say, single-minded focus on a lifelong obsession with building anime 
Sex machina and ammonium ages falcon eyes. Those are cool arms. <clears throat> I have to craft them. I need a legion plug. I want the ages, it looks so cool. Falcon eyes is pretty dope, too, though. I would need legion plugs to make any of these. I do have a high powered flame amplifier though. So I could make this. Is it worth like making these or are the high powered like or are these items like the legion plug and the high powered flame amplifier better used elsewhere? Stick with the full uh, full uh, full minutes for now. I never use the other arms. That's fair. I can't the original one because it's lighter. No, that's fair. Some are probably sir. decent, but it's another combat mechanic to keep track of. Uh, that's fair. In luxury merchandise. I believe you'll find all items to be both superior quality and distinguished provenance. I am certain you will be able to find something that suits you, sir. At the house of Vanini, even priceless things have a price. Every item is a treasure of distinguished quality and superior provenance. Let's see here. Mo motivity crank. Alright. Don't mind me, I'm just reading these real fast. Uh, technique crank. Advanced crank. Balance crank. Electric blitz grindstone. And then we got the various fibers. Excuse me. Not my legion armor. Ah, then my eyes do not deceive me. I never imagined I'd actually see it again, and in the flesh, so to speak. So to speak. I just designed it, set it aside, and never got back to it. Genius and the claim can keep one quite preoccupied, I'm afraid. Ah, uh, humble brag. You are really interested in the arm, I see. Then, my friend, you shall have it. It just needs a few mechanical adjustments to fit your um, particular needs. 
And frankly, this design is almost child's play to me now, so let's start by making it a bit stronger, shall we? I will also add what we brilliant inventors call modularity. That means it will be much easier to improve and repair since you'll be able to use commonly found parts. You might say this arm's new abilities are... Uh, legion! <laughs> no? Too much? It was too much. So, what did he do? You can craft a leech arm with the Lee with a leechin plug. Use any machine at the hotel. Yay! I got it. Go away. Thank you. Alright, go say hi to my dad. Dad! Dad! Hi, Dad. Remember. I didn't design no, every puppet in Krat. Yeah, go! It is not surprising that some puppets broke away from the Grand Covenant. I've no idea how many. I remember a few ergo puppets behaving according to their own volition before the frenzy. That wasn't our intention. They were never designed to act that way. But if a puppet starts acting on its own, does that mean the puppet has free will? Or is someone else controlling the puppet? I mean, that's a tough question right there. I can't use that in here. I guess we go back now. I do imagine like somebody watches me as I'm teleporting away and it's just like ah. like I vanished or something like that you know Master. Oh, these guys are very dead. A lot of moonstones. Making a new weapon after this rapier will be fairly easy. Rain ergo fragment. Taken down. What we got? Gemini's iron protection. Oh, Gemini's iron protection. It's a, Gemini, listen, this version of Gemini and Gemini are spelled the same way. Oh, I'm going down into a mine. 
what's the worst that could happen, you know? That hurt. What the fuck? And I died. There's a guy above him that also threw. God damn it. These guys who throw shit is, are, are getting very annoying. And by getting, I mean they are. If I fall down, would I die? I mean, I am a puppet. Listen, they made this here, the ladder for a reason. Big wrench. I mean, cool. Probably not for my build, but I mean, you know. I could hit people with a big wrench. It's a comfy room. Dark, dark moon, moonstone of the covenant. Hmm. Might as well get back to full health. I don't know what lies ahead of me.
Why? Sir, why are you here? There you go. Okay. We good? No? Why do you keep trying to hit me? Does that increase my carrying capacity? You have my attention. Ooh, Stargazer. Still refilled, yeah. These bodies. Could they be from Moonlight Town? Whoa, did puppets do this? I mean these guys are very dead. I would assume either the puppets did it or there was some kind of serial killer who really did it. Are you like, hitting me with your separate uh, your severed arm? bomb guys like uh, they're the most irritating thing in the world god damn it Like it wasn't even difficult, it was just annoying. <laughs> hmm. I can't go in the well, which is a it's a bad sign. broke that wagon with a rapier. I'm very strong. Oh, this is a drop point. But this goes over here. Yeah, I guess if I wanted a shortcut. 
We're gonna go the traditional way first. Legion magazine. Honestly, I wish I wish I knew better like what everything is. Like, like, oh fuck! Well, um, bridge is out. Problem. Do I go in the town or do I go down there first? I feel like I should explore down here first. I feel like the town is the way to go. I would be correct. Moonlight Town Guide. Town is the lowest point place in the city, where pilgrims prepare for their journeys. Sir and Saint Fra Frangelico met the one-winged angel and founded the church. Moonlight Town has become known as the place where pilgrims are lifted to the cathedral by pulley and prepared for their pilgrimage. Adrius reputa Adrius's reputation was at its peak when he was appointed as a priest. At the time, Karat was only a poor or country town. But Andreas uh, didn't mind and devoted himself to taking care of the people. They were even saying that Saint Frangelico himself had returned. Moonlight Town actively helped the priests' good deeds and always acted together as colleagues who deliver the word of God. The decision to accept the alchemists from outside and revive Krat was made in Moonlight Town. After all, it was the birthplace of Krat we know today. Today we have came we have cable car railways instead of pulleys and the city of the future instead of a country village. But our virtues remain unchanged. Just like how the angel wrapped Saint Frangelico in his wing when he fell in the cold uh, in the cold, people should help each other. The place uh, lower than any other Moonlight Town is proof of that virtue is still here. Until now. But the one winged angel, the sad part is it's like I wanna think of like, oh that's so cool, it's very biblical, but my only thought is Sephiroth from Final Fantasy. The one winged angel. So, uh, by the way, um, bridge is out. Uh. I fell through there. Oh. I just wanted to be in the shape of me. And just, ah! <laughs> mm. Like, and then, like, another hole to save my sword as I just... Yeah. It's like that, uh, it's like that trap that uh, Doofenshmirtz made for Perry the Platypus. Mm -hmm. One is the door trap, and it's like one of them is like Perry with a banana, and it's just like, you were hungry that day. <laughs> yeah. Wow, these people are very dead. Um. Mm. You know, it's kind of surprising that the puppets didn't, you know, bother putting them in the graveyard. Right. It's like right here. Oh, 
on. I got pinched again. Fuck. Stop. Oh, I hate you. God, I fucking... Oh, I like Dark Souls. Environment and camera are also not your friend. You fucking... No! God, I really fucking hate that this is a purely a dex based game. At least get an item out of this. Workshop Union Standard Corrosion Resistance Converter. Quite the mouthful. Saw blade. Don't know what the saw blades do, but they do saw. Oh, this is a trap. The graveyard. More dead people. Hello. Do you want to go up, child? Yes. I'm sorry, but the train isn't in service anymore. Oh, okay. The cathedral isn't the sanctuary it once was. All right. The people who went up there never returned. You want me to go check on? I still don't know what happened, but I do know this. The cathedral is off limits. Forever. I need to go if up. If you're determined to pass, you must prove your identity. Who are you? Are you a stalker? Interesting. I thought all the stalkers died when the workshop tower collapsed. As for me, I'm as good as dead. A sinner who lost everyone I ever loved. I have no right to stop someone as determined as you. Thank you. Please be safe up there. 
Ergo is whispering. Please be safe up there. Okay. Taking the railway. This this, gives, this right here gives me like Bioshock vibes. Town, we hope your preparations for the Pilgrim's Journey are well underway. Fascinating town, Moonlight, just fascinating. Back in the day, the only way to reach the cathedral was using a rope and pulley. <laughs> so, thanks for building it on a cliff, St. Frangelico. I kid, I kid, Frangelica. Wonderful saint, wonderful. Anyway, next stop, the Bridge of Atonement. While you atone there, don't miss a magnificent view of the beautiful crot. <laughs> it's been my pleasure, friends, and enjoy the rest of your journey. I've been your captain on this ride, Gemini! Well, not bad, huh? Oh, I really am good at this. When in doubt, let Gemini be your guide. <laughs> you, uh, you look annoyed. What I do... Ah, I'm sure it's fine. Let's get a move on, pal. Agreed. Oh, something's off. Do you see that over there? I recognize dead puppets. That's to be expected. But what is that? Well, um, should we comment about all the dead people that are just right here? Like, there's a lot. Like, there's a path of corpses. Okay. Oh, no idea what those things are, pal. Approach with caution. They look like clickers mixed with hollow. Jesus. They're fast. Yeah. No idea where I'm going, but I'm going somewhere. Yeah, they look like clickers from Last of Us merged with hollows from Dark Souls. And any other to repair. for a later location. Alright then. 
Yeah, that one's say, Jiminy. Do you think their open skulls and moving flesh uh, mean their bodies have been altered? This area reminds me a lot of the uh, cathedral from Dark Souls 2. Do you guys remember that area? It was the one where it was on fire at the bottom. Woman's Prayer. God, I pray with all my heart. Please withdraw your wrath from Crot. Just as you enveloped Saint Frangelico with the angel's wings, please save us all as well. If the judgment was unavoidable because of our corruption, please let us spare, please at least spare my child your wrath. This baby has done no wrong. Please let my Charlotte enter heaven. If there's anyone who finds this place, please pray for us. Know that there was desperate sadness here. All right, then. Pray you who are exhausted and injured. Okay. Fire eraser. Okay, that just continues on to the next area. Oh, did I accidentally go to the boss room? Um... Can I turn my ass around? Okay, this looks like something straight out of an Orlando. That looks like something straight out of an Orlando. Or Bloodborne. Or both. Or both. Both is good. But before I progress. I do. I like both a lot. Hello. Ah, mercy, I beg you, don't kill me. I won't. I thought you were from the organization. Nope. Uh, never mind. My name is Janjo. I'm an Hi, a, a pharmacist. Yes, pharmacist. I'm looking for the legendary gold coin fruit. I was able to use medicine to slow the infection spread. I have the petrification disease and I need a cure. Sorry, I ramble when I'm nervous. Read this. It'll explain things faster than I can. Okay. Gulamar Golemi's Ballad. Golemi, the king's knight, found the shining tree on the Rocky Mountain. The tree's fruit resembles gold coins, and this fruit is a miraculous blessing. For many people who have recovered from different diseases and who have been able to escape the plague, the elated knight built a castle and he called himself the Holy Knight. But remember, senor, but remember, uh, senoros, senores, sin, eh. 
Miracles have a price, no matter how captivating they may be. Many substances can be poisonous. The precise dose is what separates medicine from poison. Fair. The gold coin fruit might just be a myth. But in the midst of an My epidemic, it might be our salvation. C can you let me know if you find it? I'll give you this by way of payment. Thank you both. Sorry. No, you're fine. Uh, wish stone. You are... There are various kinds of wish stone. You could be equipped to use the cubes. Uh, using cubes consumes wish stones. You get equipped to wish stone, do a cube, and replenish it through... Uh, Gianjo's or a stargazer. The people of ancient Krat knew how to bottle a wish upon a star. Ah. They claimed special powers after distilling the wish into a cube made from a meteorite. All right. I don't know how it works, but, but it's said to react to someone who has ergo and grant them power. If you can help me with the gold coin tree, I'll give you more of this. You will rise up and look after the land of God when the angel spreads its wings uh, and embraces the saint and the cold is forgotten. Belford break cartridge. Alright. I'm headed to the St. Frangelico Cathedral. You can find me there if you need me. Okay. He's my new friend. All right. Well, it's time to keep going. Okay. Oh fuck. I dodged badly. I dodged very badly. quite a ways.
I knew that was gonna happen. As a canister, start fragment, hidden moonstone, damn Erico fragment. I mean, I got a decent amount from him, but goddamn. Damn Erico fragment. Attribution. That's the only way to go. I'm gonna go level up twice. correctly which I don't think I am there we go you're changing somehow oh that is how you are unique <coughs> you can go beyond <coughs> the puppets limits I don't even know if Geppetto is aware of this oh learn from how humans behave how they feel even lie if you must. Those lies may change you, may rewrite reality. Lies yep. are a weapon used by humans who thrive in a world of deception. I mean, fair. I'll use my power to help you. Alright, let's see here. Go ahead and boost up. 
capacity, vigor, and... Oh, I need like 400 more to level up a third time. again. Give me ever closer to 400 health. Welcome to Hout. 2800 for quartz. Which is not terrible, actually. Now. How about stalkers? The stalkers are Kratz vigilantes. There are two groups of them. The bastards and the sweepers. The bastards. the bastards are an organization of guards for the alchemists and the workshop. Motto, honor or nothing. The sweepers are an organization of guards for the old families of Krat. Motto, we always repay what is owed. Historically, the relationship between the two groups has been turbulent. But most were killed in the puppet's full-scale attack. All right, then. That is what little I know beyond the hotel walls. May I serve you in some other way? Um, uh, no. Thank you, though. Let's say hi to our friend. People have no ideas. Thanks for keeping me company. I see you're here. Your lives are people on the outs. All right. Just wanted to say hi, catch up, you know. All right. Saint Prangelico's Church. Their cathedral. Excuse me. Let me go a little farther just because I'm curious. Do the enemies respond? No, they don't. That's just a great space of emptiness now. Let's talk to our friend. Um, oh, it's you! Gold coin trees are said to blossom when plague stalks the land. P -p Perhaps they've already bloomed somewhere in Krat. Possibly. The, the people of ancient Krat knew how to Who tracked the blood in the church? Star. I don't know, but they have but the disrespect. Special powers but it's a 30 Hail Marys into a cube made from a meteorite. It's said to react to someone who has ergo and grant them special power temporarily. Maybe you'll find a star to wish on, Stalker. <laughs> and if you do, I hope this cube helps you with that. Thank you. You who have sinned, repent with your tears. Only those who have cleansed their souls may have moved forward. Well, I hate to be the bearer of bad news. I'm the best you got. I'm a puppet, and I'm the best you got. What the fuck is that? Excuse me? Stained choir sheet music. The original score is unrecognizable because of there's a sticky blue fluid over it. Someone wrote, Angel, why did you abandon us? The cathedral scares me. I want to go home. Every night there's a monster crying in the basement. Even if I sing hymns, I can hear it in my ears. It'd be better, it'd be better if the Archbishop was with us. 
He, but he's busy praying. Angel, please hear our prayers. Help us go home, please. that I saw some kind of tentacle. That's quite the ways down. So let's explore a little bit. Vivid ergo fragment. Give decay. I think it looks like it should be straight out of Diablo. Oh boy, I really don't trust the maneuvering I'd have to do to get there. But I mean like, worst case scenario, I fall down. Fuck! I fell. Well, the worst case scenario happened, guys. I fell. At least I took like minimal damage for it, so. Looks like you need to drop there. It doesn't look like it's very capable of just getting there. Welcome to the area's version of a Nor Londo scaffolding. Ah! Makes sense. Fuck. Oh, ow! Well, I fell. So you can die from. Well, die from heights. Not the way I wanted to find out. But alright. This is going to be a pain. 
야. that I'm covering in decay though. Try this again without falling. can jump, but not very far, so... Okay, that's where I need to go. I can keep falling to my death. <laughs> uh, it also bounces me all the way back here. Broke your pew. Because I wanted to. Okay, well, let's try this again. Down this way, to the right. To the right again, and then down this ladder, and I'm gonna slide. This takes blue blooded to a whole another level. I mean, yeah, that would be that's a very accurate statement. And we're gonna go through here, and then we're gonna go ahead and go through here, and I'm gonna go ahead and kill these guys real fast so I don't have to deal with them every time I fall because it's gonna happen. my health bag, which I'll take. Now I'm going up. Now I'm going to go over here. And now you're dead. Now here you come. And we're going to go over here. We're gonna do this and we're gonna dodge because you're gonna fall to your death and I'm gonna go up. And then I'm right here and then I'm gonna sharpen my blade real fast on my knee. And then I'm gonna make my way downtown, walking fast, face it fast, and I'm about. No, no, fuck, shit! God 
damn it. Bro. Ah. I really hate this. Uh, this might be my least favorite thing in the game. Because this feels very cheap. It feels like I'm in fucking, uh... Feels like I'm in Blight Town in Dark Souls. Fuck each of these guys. I'm already losing Ergo. I have fully come to terms that I'm probably not going to get my Ergo back. Because I'm going to keep dying, because that's just the way this is. Tell me, does this not look like a creature that belongs in, like, Diablo? Oh, no, I don't know. Yeah, because, like, the bulging, like, things and the fact that they mm -hmm. pull stuff from inside of them. Mm -hmm. One arm's like a club. Mm -hmm. Looks like something straight out of Diablo. Diablo. That's Spanish for devil. It is. El Diablo. El Diablo. <laughs> Does not pass, and then I'm gonna run across. I don't think that's worth it. I'm gonna go get it, but I don't think it's worth it. He he he, knob. Star fragment. I mean, okay, it was. It's, it's all right. The item isn't worth it. It really isn't. It's not terrible, but it's not great. I've well, I mean, I'm gonna say spot now. I'm on a ladder. What is it? it it's a uh, caramel apple tea. Oh, okay. A bit hot right there. That's very hot. Okay, Winter, you don't use star fragments. I will doctor it up. I'm gonna doctor it up here, but... It's kind of bland. Yeah, I'm gonna doctor it up. It also is very hot. <laughs> yes, I'm gonna doctor it up. It is literally terrible. Well, you know what, Tiny? Nerds to you. <laughs> My lips feel burned. I'm sorry. It's okay. Um, am I supposed to go up or? I don't like this. Go, go, go. No! Come on! That's such bullshit! <laughs> That was such bullshit. Okay, here we 
we go again. Hey guys, welcome back to my fail compilation, where I'm uh, literally just running through the same parts of the same dungeon over and over again. Don't want to risk getting hit. God, please be a shortcut. I don't have Trinity key, but I, it's good to know that that's there. The problem is, I haven't found another telephone to answer. Archbishop is dead. Those who are still alive must flee from the dead. Just keep pushing forward for now. Please, for the love of God, let there be a goddamn stargazer somewhere near here.
Now this is a shortcut from down there to up here. That's still quite the ways. This feels like a boss room. We'll get to that. Alrighty. Crescent Moonstone, so which means I can boost up my weapon to be a plus four. Okay, if I wanted to drop down that way, I could, but I'm not going to. I'm just gonna. Lop. I guess only one way to go. you want from me? Man, boy howdy do I love coming back here. You aren't far from unlocking the boss. Thank God, then I can never come back here again because fuck this level. It's still not as bad as, like, Blight Town, but fuck this place. God damn. There's also a staircase that goes downwards, which I'm curious about. cryptic vessel. Have any need to code the cryptic vessel uh, to obtain a hidden clue. Cool. Legion bug, so it means I can create and modify a legion arm. Actually, I'm very curious about using the Aegis.
if you could, for the love of God, give me a goddamn stargazer that isn't the beginning of the map. That would be great. Supply box. Can expand uh, Polandina shop. Cool. Oh goody, I love it that it goes down. Thank God. hear that voice? There she is. Hello. I'm surprised to see who's well alive. Oh, where are my manners? I'm Cecile, and I serve the Archbishop. I'm the only one left. Okay. Everyone's dead. From the petrification disease, or from okay. the monsters. I didn't die, but my heart breaks more each day. Fair. Can you do me a kindness? Bring me the holy mark from the Archbishop's quarters. The Archbishop was a true saint. He was my savior. If I write his words into my heart, maybe it'll give me the strength to carry on. I can't die. But perhaps this can help me live again. Please. Bring me so, the a holy mark a from the Archbishop's quarters. Okay. I'll see what I can do, ma'am. All that does is make me want a hot chocolate. Oh shit, this is a decay. Fuck, I wasn't thinking. So from the Archbishop's office. Now that's where Cecil is. Okay. Again. Kind of tastes like a like a blander apple cider. It's still good, just meh. I don't know where it is, I just explore, which is fair. Ow, ow. Damn traps. When you, oh, for fuck's sakes, I fell. And, oh, I, oh! This place is cursed. It is an abyss of hell. You cannot leave. The only thing that's waiting for you is despair. When you get to where you were on the scaffolding, did you ever see large bolts of fire? Yes, I did. And I pushed it off and I just got rid of the decay. They call it the arm of God. You are arrogant ones. You have called the wrath of God upon yourselves. Nice. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna retreat because I didn't realize that I didn't stop at the stargazer. I found it. I didn't stop at it. <laughs> so I had no healing flasks. And now I have healing flasks again. 
I mean... Oh my god, are there multiple triggers? these cocoons of decay. They're kind of gross. And by kind of, I mean, yeah. This is why the cathedral was built and remembered. Pilgrims worship the merciful angel. Okay. Is it moonstone? Okay, I need to get over there to be able to go over there and to be able to get rid of this decay. to go all the way around. God, this is going to be tedious. Maybe an ergo fragment. Shit, fuck shit. of a trip. share and leave oh for fuck's sake so you a boss fight oh. <laughs> oh, that's odd hello Aladora. I thought I was the only one with a sound mind here well sure I don't need to introduce myself note these golden wings yes you guessed it you don't know who I am preposterous everyone in Kraut has heard of me do you live under a rock Yes. I'm Alidoro the Hound. Oh. Treasure right. hunter extraordinaire. Yes, yes, it's a nickname. I ditched my real name in the past. Right, right. I'm looking for other... This guy. ...survivors of this disaster, but it's uh, been a lonely search, and there's danger around every corner. You're right. Do you know of a place where I can take refuge? Preferably someplace clean and comfortable, you know, civilized. Yes. Hotel Krat. Of course. A haven for all. And it's still safe and sound, you say. I have a lot of searching ahead of me, so why don't I lighten my load? Consider this an act of charity. A thank you gift. Take it. 
Firebase. Since you're so helpful, I'll give you a peek at my collection. As a descendant of aristocrats, the very best family. I mean, he doesn't seem like I an asshole, so I mean, common people. I live my he just life seems arrogant, which I mean, fair. Duty. And part of that duty is ensuring these items are returned to their rightful owners. Excuse me. What I'm showing you is just a portion of the collection. If you come to the refuge, we'll be able to continue our confabulation. Confabulation. Until then, remember this hound. Ray Ergo. Yeah, he doesn't seem bad. He doesn't seem like an asshole. He just, again, he just seems cocky and overconfident. But, I mean, he also has survived. So, I mean, fair? Kale's strong enemy is to gain Rare Ego. Aladoro is a treasure hunter who collects this rare Ergo. You can exchange it for, er, for Aladoro's precious weapons or amulets. Seven, Coil Spring Sword. Pretty cool. Uh, Etiquette, which is pretty cool. And, oh, these are boss weapons. Holy Sword of the Ark. Because this is from the parade leader, this is from uh, the from the police officer, and then this is from the... Uh... That's pretty cool. But you can also get the Conqueror's Amulet. Upon this, uh, successful perfect guard, temporarily increased damage inflicted by weapon attacks. That's really useful. Increased weapon attack in proportion to number of Fable slots. That's pretty useful. And enables dodging even with low stamina. That is actually very useful. Uh, this is more on motivity and technique. But etiquette is high on technique, which is what I've been boosting up. This might be a conversation for later. I have to think on this. Thank you. Thank you, Aladoro. I'm sorry, I thought I was gonna have to kill you. Was it seriously a fucking dead end? Hold on. Oh, there isn't a, like, a ladder or something near you, is there? No. This would be a gorgeous place to sit down and just stare at things, because this is very pretty. God damn it. This is a dead end. Fuck. It's like I could have lied, but like, who cares, you know? Staircase hidden right here. drop, but whatever. This is where I can get rid of the decay. Archbishop's Diary. Cecil is un Cecil's unwell again. Today, Brother Adam found her standing like one of the dead at the ed edge of a cliff and brought her back. If it's a mild sleepwalking, it's fine, but I'm worried it's her old blood compulsiveness again. I know about her strong beliefs better than anyone else, so it's really too bad. God will be glad to win the, with the atoned. Perhaps I should ask her for atonement for visiting the Isle of Alchemists. I have their relic in my hand, thanks to Cecil. 
I won't let those bastards ruin crotch anymore. This will purify the city. Maybe it was a mistake to accept those guys from the beginning. This disaster was divine judgment. They should have been turned away all those 30 years ago, but this will be the end. Krat is a city blessed by God, and I, Andreas, will come to its rescue. This journal is badly torn. The, the journal is badly torn. Why me? I don't know. Why you? Archbishop's Holy Mark, which is what I could give this easel. Workshop, Union Strike Thing Frame. off. Big push and gone. Able catalyst. Talk to Cecil. Hey girl, how you doing? Oh, thank you. Just seeing the Archbishop's holy mark renews my spirit. It's a reminder of the quiet. Now for boss, I've been kinda I've been kinda quiet for a while, but I'm excited. I'll remember this forever, Stalker. You're welcome. Happy I can help. It's a reminder of the quiet. Make sure you equip the special grindstone. I will, I will, but first, I'm gonna go spend my ergo so I'm not take, taking it into battle. How many do I need to level up again? 3,300? Yeah, so I'll just level up twice. Talk to a few people. First things first. I'll use my power to help you. Thank you, Sophia. Let's boost up technique and capacity. Next up, Benini. Hmm, isn't this uh, a cryptic vessel? Well, I would expect nothing less from you. What I mean, of course, is that this is a humble invention of mine. A cipher device. Once your information is locked in here, only you can get it out. <laughs> of course, once people realize the value of a truly unbreakable way to keep secrets, knockoffs flood the market. The trials and travails of true genius, forever copied, never credited. But, I admit, even some of these knockoffs could still hold secrets. You're welcome to take a crack at, uh, well, cracking it. Who knows? It could lead you to something truly valuable. Or at least more practical. Okay. Uh, decipher the cryptic vessel. May I be of assistance? I can decipher this in moments, if you'd allow me. Okay. I admit I'm a bit rusty, but it's all starting to come back to me. Genius never sleeps and never truly abandons the truly brilliant. 
What? No, of course I didn't read the contents. Who has time to read anymore? But uh, I could help you read it if you want to. Orders. Strike the puppet hanging from the Alchemist Bridge on Elysium Boulevard. A message to Adelina. Dear Adelina, I've prepared a shelter for you. It's in an, it's an apartment on Elysium Boulevard. You can stay there until everything settles down. I've arranged for someone to take you there. Once you get to the Alchemist Bridge on Elysium Boulevard, you're safe. The address and the key are hidden on the puppet hung from the Alchemist Bridge. Ask, the, ask your escort man to strike the puppet. The shelter was supposed to be our first home, but I guess, ne but I guess next time. To make up for what happened, I'm escorting the alchemists for a bit. We're going to San Saint Frangelico Cathedral and all the way to the Grand Exhibition. Maybe the mission is to bring petrification disease cures to the refuge uh, refugees. I'll be able to, to. I'll be. I'll be back as soon as it's done. I always welcome. Of course, you're curious. Pulcinella has been restored thanks to you. In a small way. Mostly it was me, but uh, you know, genius never rests. Except for beauty rest. <laughs> Pulcinella isn't just my butler. He's my family. The only one I have left, really. I won't forget what you've done for us. No. If you ever need anything or... Find yourself in a spot of trouble. Call on your friend Venigni. I always welcome. Uh, about the puppet frenzy. No one, not even I, know what started the puppet frenzy. Why? That day of all days. Ah, it was horrible. A violent rampage of murder and mayhem that is seared into my memory for all time. And it was never supposed to happen again. I made sure of it. Designed a few special parts to ensure they'd remain loyal. Puppet armies do not arise by chance. There was intent behind mm -hmm. this. I don't want to leap to conclusions, but... The only one I know with that kind of power is the King of Puppets himself. I... We... Need to learn how this happened. Fair enough. And let's see how my other friend is here. I know Tepeto's in there. No. Excuse me. Is he not here? Kind of mind boggling. Rosa Isabel Street. Maybe he's outside. I don't want to imagine he'd be, but...
maybe I need to defeat the boss for uh, my uh, boss weapon making friend. All right, let's do this. Last thing I do before I call it for the night. Cecil's doing okay. She's doing okay. It's a reminder of the quiet. Okay, Cecil. We want to make sure you're doing okay. All right. And Satan prays that the new Satan has arrived. I, Saint Andreas, will consecrate this land. Also, my uh, error goes at 369. Hey, Abby. Yeah. My error goes at 369. Is that nice? Okay, I didn't hear you. Yeah, because you have your headphones on. Of course you can hear Oh, so the saint was that creature. Oh, you're a giant centipede. Oh, I don't like that. Sir, why are you like this? Oh my gosh, you look like, uh... You look like the face stealer from Avatar The Last Airbender. Unfortunately, it's a direct shot. Unlike Frigate Bloodborne, I could just go directly to it.
Should have boosted my weapon into a plus four. Whatever. I could do it right now if I wanted to. Well, I'll give it one more shot or what it. Understandably so. Right, let's boost our weapon into a plus four real fast. I know you don't like to parry, but... Uh, uh, parrying is almost hard in this game. <laughs> I'll do it if I have to, but... Parry system is hard in this game. I know my way around a weapon. Got it this time. Watch it now. Work, work. Get up, baby. Work, work. Twist and shout. Alright.
getting the timing down for parrying him is hard. And I want to play it more like Bloodborne and that's like Zekiro. But I understand I gotta work here. I, if I would have gotten that second block. Getting that overheat like on him is like crucial. When Decay is up, I can't heal? I didn't... Oh my for fuck's sakes. I literally was trying to heal and like I wasn't allowed. So I'm, I'm just going to assume that Decay prevents me from healing. Decay occurs when acid damage builds up for both the added character. Blah, 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 blah. It increases destruction damage I'll do. The higher acid resistance, the slower the decay gauge fills. Yeah, I get that. Decay doesn't prevent healing. I was clicking it and it was not working. Like, I had a sizable distance away. There was no way he could... Might have not, just not had the input go through, which does not make any sense whatsoever. It's my square button. I don't know what happened. Fucking game.
you. Beat him. That fire is that like fire upgrade is very u useful. is a phase two. Well, I see a one wing angler. This fucking level. One half is basically phase one if you can stay facing it. Well, now I know. Phase two is what gave me trouble. I had. Yeah, so you have to be, like, really good at phase one. fight all over again.
That is such bullshit! How are you gonna just pull out a one hit KO move that I can't even dodge? That's such utter horseshit. He has a beam, I'm sorry. That's such bullshit! Fuck sakes. That was a really good attempt. You'll get it. I know I'll get it eventually, but fuck sakes, that's so fucking cheap. Fuck it. Always a little bit further than the planet. Anyways, fuck it. I'm gonna get like I get one good attempt, and I'm gonna have like 30 bad attempts until I get a good one again.
get. Phase two. God, that takes up the majority of my health. So unless I have like full health, there's no way, and even then... Fuck, God, fucking damn it, fuck this! Yes, Jesus Christ. GG, you're finally dead, thank God. Praise the sun. Praise the sun. What was gone? That was close greed paid off. Agreed. Dude, I had no more healing. Like, if I would have, if I would have fell, like there, in, even if I would have backed up, I don't even think I would have had an opening. 
the hell? And now, the stage is set. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Eliminated Twisted Angels. I want to go. go back to the old Krat, the old me. Before the green overtook me. This is weird. This is a weird advice, I guess. But only when you get a critical hit, if you only have one flask left, use it. Then, then do the critical. Honestly, you're not wrong. A critical will most likely charge. Or yeah. <coughs> but you know what they say. You don't end up thinking about it in the moment. There's a record? Where's the record in the library? Just something you don't think about it in the moment. Cecil's written confession, divine service. Thank you for your kindness. I'm a sinner who murdered innocent people in the past. I couldn't suppress the monster in me. Only the Archbishop saved me. Of course, he was a human who makes mistakes. Even saints succumb to wealth and power. But at least I can live as myself, and that's a huge blessing. So yes, I believe you that he was a saint. You now, now you open the second path. Thank you for letting me live as a human, not a monster. Farewell, Cecil. It's slowly tr turned redder. It must be evidence of the rose-colored love. You will whisper again soon. For God, for the beloved, divine service for the affair. Okay. There's two. There are three things left I'm going to do tonight before I turn this off. And I turn off the stream. One is level up because I have all these air I have all this air going and it needs to go. Ergo, I must use it. Crat supply box can expand and hold the other shot. It seems nowhere is safe. Maybe those who went there seeking refuge became monsters somehow. Probably. But the petrification disease turns you to stone, not into a monster. Unless the alchemist did something stupid. I'm worried stupid. about the Malum district, just below the cathedral. I wonder whether there are monsters there, too. Probably. I'm gonna go ahead and boost up. Okay, now I need to go to the bridge. Would that be the entrance? I think it would be the entrance. Granted, I haven't quite figured out how I'm going to hit the puppet. And I also don't know if this is the right place. I very well... I think I'm in the wrong place. It's, uh, it's closer to City Hall. <coughs> I'm pretty confident anyways. Yes. Okay.
Letter from with the refugee's address. Address with the refugees. Ellison Boulevard, 221. Love Adeline, Adel, Adelina. A key is enclosed. Where the hell is that? I know that's here, but where is that here? Ellison Boulevard. Uh, no, that doesn't sound right. Legion Boulevard. Backtrack to get back to Elysian Boulevard. Otherwise, I'll have to look up a map. The problem here is I'm going off of. Okay, so... Yada yada yada. You can find 21 Elysian Boulevard closed to the inside the house. Gazer near it? Just head out the door onto the balcony and then turn right and then walk over to the plank. Doctors hunting a barrel and a quartz, which I will gladly take. I really wanted to do that just because I knew I would forget if I waited until the next time I played this. All right, and we're heading back. stream the way I ended the first one. We're going to listen to a new song. Divine Service.
lot of records. Take this beat. And I know that there is obviously an acoustic guitar and a violin. I'm trying to figure out what that third instrument is. Would that be an accordion? Fingers, uh, fingers crossed the song is a copyrighted. I still feel like the ergo is whispering. I still feel like feel. Close your eyes. Like is still my favorite. Close your eyes. Feel alright. Just dance with me over the line. Turn it around. The best one. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, I want to listen to all of them to have a full opinion, but as far as my opinion goes so far, I would agree. Kitty 
cat's gone. Oh, it's you. <coughs> this hotel. I am the Hound, a descendant of the city's most aristocratic. Anyone with a worthy spirit is especially welcome. Accordingly, I shall give you the honor of laying out. However, you must prove your worthiness. It's up to you if you want to make the exchange. Mm. The Trident of the Covenant. Which is pretty cool. That's actually really useful. Now, where'd the cat go? But either way, this is where I'm going to end the stream, guys. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Call of Dark Souls, of course. As always, thank you so much for hanging out with me, dude. But as yeah, I'll be back at it again tomorrow <coughs> with some more Bloodborne. <coughs> as I'm playing through the rest of the DLC. And also continuing to play through the entirety of the game. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful night. Have a good one. You too, bud. Stay frosty, my friends.